Hi, I'm Rams punter Johnny Hecker here with the 2014 Youth Football Coach of the Year, Nathan Laws, to help present the St. Louis Rams' next pick of the 2015 NFL Draft. You ready to go, Nate? Let's do it. With the 20th pick of the fourth round, number 119 overall, the St. Louis Rams select Andrew Donnell, tackle Iowa. Well, there you have it, the third tackle selected in this draft so far. the selfie. By the Rams. Can't wait to see that one on social media. Uh, certainly offensive line a need for this team. Boy, are they addressing it. So this is a guy that I like, um, Andrew Donald. And I like him much later. But everyone talked about Brandon Sheriff. Watch number 78, the right tackle. Every time I turned on the tape, he stayed in front of his man as a pass protector. You'll see here the ability to move and slide, uh, finds the tackles. Kirk, you know, This is Iowa offensive linemen are going to be well schooled and technically sound. But look at the slide out there. Hands are inside. Nice punch. He is a proficient pass protector, which, which begs this question. You've got Rob Havenstein, who's a, definitely a tackle. You've got Andrew Donald, who I think is, is a tackle. Maybe they view him differently. Mm -hmm. Jamon Brown, who is a tackle, who I think has to be a guard. What do you do with Greg Robinson? Are you basically saying that you think – because I don't think Havenstein or Donald is a, is a left tackle, so that means Greg Robinson has to stay there. So one of those guys, um, Andrew Donald, they may view him as a guard. Mm -hmm. Or they just say, hey – we can never have enough quality pass protecting tackles. Maybe that's the, the thought because they have, They're like all I said about before, the have been all about the wow. other line so far this draft. Bucky, given the offensive line picks they've made so far, how do you feel like Donald fits in? You know, I think with all of the offensive line picks that they've made, it's about trying to come up with the right combination to solidify their team. When I look at their depth chart, the one question that I have, how good is Barrett Jones going to be in the NFC West? Is he physical enough to deal with those defenses? Maybe they're looking to move one of those players inside to give them a little more physicality and toughness at the point of attack so they can run the football. We've seen them load up on running backs. They want to run the football. you got to have some knockback guys at the point of attack to be able to do so.